Tonight, a community in shock after an out of state plane crash killed a mother and her two teenagers from West Baton Rouge. An eyewitness says the plane just fell from the sky. Fallon Brown has the gut wrenching story. She's live in the newsroom tonight. Sylvia Michael, I spoke with the principal of Port Allen Middle, where the youngest of the plane crash victims went to school. People who knew the family say each one of them was a true gift, exuding love wherever they went. Scorched earth marks the spot of a devastating plane crash. A hole there that's burned a hole in the hearts of those who knew the family on board. 49-year-old Sandra Kirby, her son, 17-year-old Ian, and daughter, 13-year-old Amanda, as well as the pilot. It was definitely not something I was expecting to wake up to on a Friday morning. Port Allen Middle School principal Jessica Major just learned what happened as news trickled in from Colorado. Amanda Kirby was going to be an eighth grader at her school this fall. One of the things that kind of breaks my heart is, as a principal, when we say goodbye in the summertime, we look forward to seeing them there again in the summer and sharing their stories. And I had just scheduled classes last week uh, for Amanda. The principal remembers Amanda as a charismatic student, always looking for ways to participate in school activities. One of the things she was looking forward to, joining the band to be like her older brother, Ian. So we would get to see Ian playing in the band every year, and he had such a big smile on his face. And his sister, oh, she loved being able to go participate and watch the parade because she would get to see her brother. Ian also attended Port Allen Middle before going on to Port Allen High School. He played the trumpet in the high school band. His eighth grade year, he just flourished. He had matured, he had found a group of friends, he had joined the band, and he absolutely was so excited when he was going to, I will never forget, when he was going to high school, he could not wait. With the school year set to begin in just a few weeks, it's going to be a difficult start. Principal Major says she's looking into ways to remember Amanda. That's something that's going to be really important for us to do. Um, and, it, you know, I think it's going to help us stay strong. And it's a reminder to take nothing for granted. It just reminds us tragedies like this that we cannot take for granted um, any words and actions that we have with the people that we encounter. And so I definitely are going to hug my own children a little tighter tonight. Sandra Kirby was an employee at LSU since 1998. She worked in various departments. Live in the newsroom tonight, Fallon Brown, WBRZ News 2.